UK Sports and the PGA Tour. Proud to bring you the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the John Deere Classic is about to start. Pleased you could join us for this third round action. I'm Luke Elvey, here alongside Rich Beam. And Rich, this next golfer starts their round. What do you think about their chances today? Yeah, it's right now the game plan is working, but they still have to go out there and play off the front foot, play on offense, and not worry about who's chasing them. Big day coming up. Can't wait to see how it unfolds, Rich. This should be an absolute beauty. Going and going and going. Second shot here on the first. This one looks just a fraction too long to me. A wonderful shot and a chance for birdie here on the first. This is part of about six feet coming up. On a nice line. Wonderful shot. That sets a positive tone for the player, doesn't it? And after that fine display, they are holding first spot on the leaderboard with Lydia Ko trailing in second place. I'm pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last. Let's see if they can deliver another one. Par five, players will be looking for the opportunities to make four here. But if they're out of position, sixes come on you quickly. Yeah, this is a quality looking shot, this one. That should find the short stuff. Lining up from about 230 yards here. Looks like they've got the five wood. This one is heading towards the nasty stuff. Oh, well done. Eleven feet to the cup. They'll be soaring high if this goes in. This one for Eagle. Oh, yeah, this is tracking nicely. Dee's making this look easy. Keeps surging ahead. Trying to make a statement early and often. Let's take a look at the leaderboard now after that hole, and they're currently in first. Lydia Ko holds second. Teeing off here at the third hole. Par three, just 183 yards back up the hill. Semi-blind tee shot. Going with the eight iron here. That's not what they were looking for. Oh, a little shorty Baker on that action there. Uh, I like that. Always good when you've got hands like that around the green. Yes, very smooth tempo there on that chip. And just keeping it in neutral on the leaderboard. Let's see what happens here on the fourth. Par four, 448 yards. Sweeping dog leg left to right, big tree in the middle, missed that, and you've got a simple second shot into a sliver of a green. This shot from 120 yards. They have absolutely flushed that one. Colin Morikawa, he was meant to be the original and best approach player, but I think we have a new sheriff in town. 
Our current leader is enjoying an eight stroke advantage. Setting up now on a par four. Par four, this fairway chases away from the players down the hill, so tee shots will run forever, setting up a second shot that is very simple and straightforward. That's some good golf right there. Penny, what have they got in front of them here? And from around 135 yards... That's nicely done. What are we looking at for this putt, Henny? All right, down the hill here. Got to be gentle. Ooh, right by the hole. Just four feet remaining between him and the hole. And there it is. Leading by a whopping seven shots after that one. And a par four awaits at this next hole. Par four measures just 361 yards, but only the long players will try and drive this green. The others, lay it up with an iron, wedge it on, hit it close, make your birdie. Playing this shot from around 120 yards. Oh, that one's straight at the pipe. That's an absolute ripper. What a shot. They're lining up the birdie putt here. Yes, they've made it. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Ooh, I always love these holes. Here we have a par three. Par three down the hill. It seemingly plays short, but I can promise you it doesn't. Just needs this one to kick right. Not a bad approach. Grab the putter from the caddy. You're dancing. Outside chance of the birdie, but a two putt here is still good. Oh, gee, that line was looking good, wasn't it? Oh, what a shame. That would have been a nice one to hole. Looks like a pretty straightforward five footer to me. This for par. That will work. Our leader is up by a whopping six shots now. Just a couple to play here on the opening nine. Here's the tee shot at the eighth. Par four. Every single shot plays uphill. Make sure to take plenty of club. Nicely done. And playing this one from around 120 yards out. Well, that certainly makes putting a lot easier when you can hit a shot like that. Luke, nothing gets past you. Yes, this kid is a stud. Always love these opportunities, especially when it's for birdie. 
And with that, that's their fourth birdie. Leading by six strokes after that one. Welcome to this hole. It's a par four. Par four, 485 yards, the toughest hole on the golf course. Make sure you find the fairway and get your second shot somewhere around the green to give yourself the best chance of making four. Oh, that's a high caliber shot. Playing from around 190 yards out. Opting for the five iron. Oh, that's well played. And a chance for birdie here at the ninth. Oh, these are good for the momentum, these ones. Right on eight feet. Looking for another birdie here. Okay, steady now. Just three feet to the cup. That's a good punt to make, that one. Our current leader enjoys a five-shot advantage. We've reached the beginning of the back nine, the 10th. Par five, 581 yards. Most players will be laying up for their second shots as a large pond on the right-hand side of the green will collect your golf ball if you hit a wayward one going forward in two. this type of courage rich going forward in two two big hits there knocking it on this par five and two so exciting to have an eagle putt here look at him just surging ahead at the top of the leaderboard and still in top spot after that hole keep it going here we have it trying to feed off the eagle and build on that momentum here Par four, 428 yard, tree line hole, difficult driving hole all the way around, but should you find the fairway, the second shot on a little plateau just above the fairway is very basic. Oh. Come on, you're better than that. Henny, how bad is this lie? Yeah, this ball's sitting up perfect. He's gonna have a great lie. Yep, solid connection. This is looking good. And another fine-looking strike, this one. It'll find the green. The iron play today has been absolutely stellar. Luke, the greens and regulation, just a fantastic accomplishment. Great to watch. Mark it down. That's birdie number five. And after that fine display, they are holding first spot on the leaderboard with Lydia Ko trailing in second place. Lovely momentum for this player after that birdie at the last hole. Keep it rolling. Par three plays 208 yards from the back. And saying that, this is a good birdie opportunity as the green is massive in size. Handy effort, that one. Putting for birdie here. And that putt will give them birdie number six on the day. Gotta like it, two in a row. Now seven strokes up after that hole.
And after a birdie at the last, they take the honor on the hole. Par four, back up the hill, 418 yards, the widest fairway on the golf course. Avoid all those bunkers. Second shot up the hill to a narrow green that slopes off on both sides. Time for the second shot here at the 13th. Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. That could play. That was a beauty. What have they got in front of them here, Henny? This one, guys, he's got around nine feet. Looking good. And mark it down. That's birdie number seven on the scorecard. Our leader is currently enjoying an eight-shot advantage. Time to see what this par four has in store. Par four, 357 yards. Almost every player in the field will be giving it a whirl. Knock it on, and you could be rewarded with an eagle two. You like that, didn't you? Second shot here on the 14th. Wow, that almost went in the hole. Five feet coming up to the cup. This looks good. And down it goes. Still in the lead now after that hole. The lead is getting bigger and bigger. And they'd be feeling buoyed with confidence after that birdie. Here's a good chance to maintain the momentum. Well played, mate. And this shot here coming up from around 130 yards. Yep, that'll work. That's fine. All right, Henny. What's he got in front of him here with this putt? This one's 13 feet from the cup. This is their look at birdie. Ooh. A par putt awaits. Let's take a look at the leaderboard now after that hole, and they're currently in first. Lydia Ko holds second. Stepping up to the 16th tee now. Par three only plays 153, but a tricky little green to say the least. Don't let the beauty of the river to your left swallow you in. This is a tough but fun little par three. No green in rig, but a chance to save their par. What a shot. Ah, uh, nicely done. Great chip. Moments like that deserve another viewing. Let's take a look at the replay. Yeah, Sevi would be envious of this one. What a chip in. sits in first position. Looking to ride the momentum after coming off a birdie here with this shot. 
players looking for a fast finish on the par five, 550 yards. Second shot does play up the hill, but there's plenty of room to miss your second shot around this green. Must make birdie for the players in the field. Well, after a successful drive at the 17th at TPC Deer Run, the players are faced with a question. Rich, lay up or go for it? Second shot straight back up the hill. Most players will bail just a little bit left as the green tends to run away quite a bit down the slope on the right-hand side. This is a great opportunity and possibly the final birdie opportunity on this golf course. Wow, what a shot. This one just outside seven feet to the hole. This looks like it's got the speed and the line. Well, how good's that for the Eagle? Leading by nine strokes after that one. Well, it's come down to this, the final hole. Welcome to the 18th. Hard to describe the difficulty of this tee shot unless you've actually been here. Par four, 463 yards. Missed the fairway bunker down the right-hand side, and you've got a clear shot to a very narrow green surrounded by water on the left-hand side. Yeah, give yourself a pat on the back. Opting for the 9-iron. And here we are with the third shot. <laughs> Lovely touch. Well played. Judging it beautifully. That signs off on this player's performance.